On the far side of the beast-written swamp, Mario and company found an imposing residence. This must be Merrily's mansion, squealed Princess Peach, said with glee. If our friends could only find the pure heart quickly, their quest here would end. But when has fate ever set Mario on such a simple path? Brimming with anticipation, our lucky heroes plunge into Merrily's mansion. I meant to say plucky, but I said lucky. Hello everybody, my name is River Kings, and welcome back to Super Paper Mario with Chapter 2-2, aka Treats, Tricks, and Traps. Say that five times fast, I said that wrong anyways. But here we are, we are at Merrily's mansion. Uh, first thing I want to do here is uh, get some coins that are right here, just chilling. I want to just jump and get them. Um, that's pretty much about it, really. And... As you can see, there's a chest above here. I want You could go, just go inside right away, but you might just want to hit this hidden block right here. And just go all the way to the very top. And hopefully we'll find, yes, some blocks here. Now, I believe they want you to use Princess Peach here, but I believe you could just use Mario and just get to the top of this roof here. And here you go. You'll find a uh, stopwatch item. This item is actually pretty broken in the scheme of things in this game. And here's another chest that gives you a card. Now this card is called a Cursia. This enemy we haven't seen yet, but uh, we will show it off later. And welcome inside. So now we have a new enemy here. I'm gonna scan this guy. This is a uh, Nip. They're just getting uh, <laughs> they're just getting to you out of harm's way when they kick out of the mansion. So they look scary, but they're actually quite nice. Okay, you said it. So yeah, we just gotta be careful with these guys. These guys will like to uh, try to bite you. So you wanna just go into 3D and avoid them altogether. So yeah, that's about it for this room, really. This is a kind of a short um, chapter. Um, I'd like to say so myself. Yes, we're gonna see about progress. And let's talk to this interesting character right here. Why, hello there! Big welcome! Welcome to Merly's Mansion! I'm Lady Merly's man-maid... Man-maid? Handmaid? Put on the freaking maid costume. My name is Mimi, but you can call me Mimikins if you want. You're here to see Lady Merly, aren't you? Yes, sir. Yes, ma'am. How, how super for you? Well, Lady, Lady Merly's on the second floor in the farthest room. Just head up on there whenever you're ready. Oh, golly. But listen. Don't you dare go into any other rooms I exit in or else. Enjoy your visit, okay? <laughs> All right. We have this interesting guy over here. Now, remember the top of my head, this character's called a gnaw? Yes, a gnaw. Merly's favorite pet is certainly the biggest of the bunch, but some mean person tied it down. And I think it's worried about this mean person wants to hurt you. Good gnaw. Okay. So let's go into some rooms explore. So yeah, there's that gnaw is tied up to the door there. Now, we have this mushroom here. Now, I don't know if I can actually grab this. I want to test it out. No, I cannot. But if you were to realistically try to grab this, you will fall into a trap door. Yeah, this this entire mansion is filled with traps, as you can see from the name of the chapter. So yeah, now your goal is here to fight some boos, which we can scan, because we know they're boos. And they have max HP is 4, and their attack is 1. Very cool. Alright, let's fight them. I took damage. Also, I forgot you can shake the Wiimote to get some extra points. And yeah, you can just do that to get some extra points. I totally never mentioned that. And this guy's being annoying to kill. There you go, we got him. All right. Now I think they want you to use uh, Boomer here, so. Yeah, the thing retracts itself. So you just wanna use Boomer and then just stand when the pipe opens up and you're good to go. But yeah, like I said, this chapter is actually very, very short um, in the grand scheme of things. Now, if you were to try to go over there, there's like a little door you can go to, but you can't really do anything over there. But maybe we might come back later. I believe there is an item that helps you get smaller uh, later on, so maybe we'll come back to that. Let's see, what's in this door number two? Alright, there's another mushroom. It is clearly a trap, but whatever. We gotta level up! Our attack goes up by one! Very nice. That's actually solid. Oh, even though falling down the trap door doesn't really help us in the grand scheme of things, so... Alright, we're just gonna be waiting for this pipe to come here, because exactly, that's what it does. And yeah, there's, room, there's really nothing much to this room. This is that one enemy we fought already. But I do think this, um, this chapter is very underrated. It's not my favorite... Um, 
above anything else. I think this is like one of the weaker points in the game. Just in my opinion alone. Yeah, here's some more coins. You could just like walk over these and uh, fall through your death. <laughs> to your death. And yeah, there's some uh, swoopers here. I don't think we scanned them either, so might as well. Alright, very nice. Get that nice little shaker Rooney. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. Ow. Okay, that works too. Alright, and let's get the hell out of here. Alright. Sounds nice. But yeah, like these rooms are very just just here to, you know, trap you. Yeah, it's not much going on here, really. It's just traps. Tricks, traps, and stuff. But we need to find a key. So I'd, I'd say it'd be door number four that has the key. So we're going to walk all over to the right side. And just head on over here. You're going to have a button. You press that big threatening button. And we're going to be locked in. Oh no. Whatever shall we do. Yeah, I'm being sarcastic though. But yeah, you can easily just escape the room, but you do need to stay in here. Um, you gotta wait just a moment above anything else. Wait till it gets, like, right around the chandelier. I mean, the chandelier, the vase on the right side. And then just turn into 3D. And wait for it to hit the ground. And then you can just jump over, and that's it. All you gotta do. Now we're gonna have to wait for this thing to go up. Now there's two different ways to approach this. I'm gonna try the more difficult way because there is a singular block that you can just jump on. And you gotta be very careful where you land. Let's see, I wonder if I can do this. Yeah, you can just do that. It just becomes so much easier. Ooh, first try. Okay, not bad. I'll just I'll take that. I will take that. Alright. Give me that. That is a key, so that will be the key to open up the door. And there's some blocks here you can break, so... Gotta be very careful with this platform, I mean, you are moving with a D-pad, so you gotta be very careful with your movement here. Yeah, I'm just gonna go back into 2D, 3D, whatever. I just open these up. Very simple. And yeah, I mean, it's essentially just a different way to approach this room. Uh, not much else in here, but yeah, that's how you get the key. And so, yeah, I mean, this is a very short chapter. There's not much I can really say here. Uh, Mimi, you're kind of mean, so I'm going to open this door here. Oh, whoa, whoa, hey, 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 oh my, he got me? Excuse me? Okay, all right, I was about to open the door. This man literally got me as I was about to open the door, but yeah, you're supposed to avoid that guy. There you go. Alright, we got it. I should realistically just make him leave us alone. Eek! <laughs> She's running away. I wonder why that savage thing went straight for her and paid us no mind. I like to think we look rather tasty. What do you suppose it means? This mention is quite odd. I certainly feel it holds many secrets. Yes. I'm positive it does. I mean, but yeah, that's literally about it for this chapter. It's so short. Um, but I guess. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed the video, please leave a like, subscribe, and I'll link to this once again. My name is Ruby Kings, and I see you guys in the next episode for Super Paper Mario. Uh, peace, I guess? <laughs> a very short chapter.